just a day after Delhi Deputy Chief Minister Manish Sisodia challenged the BJP to get him arrested based on a sting operation by the party, the Enforcement Directorate is conducting searches at 40 locations spread across multiple states as part of a money laundering investigation linked to alleged irregularities in the now withdrawn Delhi excise policy. Official sources said that premises linked to liquor businessmen, distributors and supply chain networks in Nellore and some other cities in Andhra Pradesh, Karnataka, Tamil Nadu and Delhi NCR are being searched. This is the second round of raids in the recent weeks regarding the case. The probe agency had last week searched around 45 locations in Delhi, Telangana, Maharashtra, Haryana, Uttar Pradesh and Karnataka in addition to raiding private individuals named in the case. Today's raids come early on a day when Delhi Minister Satyendra Jain arrested more than three months ago in a money laundering case is also being questioned regarding the liquor sales policy in Delhi's Tihar jail. Delhi Chief Minister and Amadbi Party Chief Arvind Kejriwal, who has accused the centre of misusing central probe agencies for political vendetta against his party leaders and denied any irregularities in the controversial liquor policy, will address the media soon. The liquor policy is being investigated by the CBI as well as the ED following a directive from Delhi's Lieutenant Governor VK Saxena. The CBI had also conducted raids in the case on August 19th, covering the Delhi residences of Delhi Deputy Chief Minister Manish Sodia, IAS officer and former Delhi Excise Commissioner Aravagopi Krishna and 19 other locations across seven states and union territories. Subscribe to One India channel and never miss an update.